All right, here we go, people. Another day, another chance to open a pack and get some bangers. Let's go ahead and uh, and crack into this pack, shall we? <clears throat> See if we can pull some really big hits. <clears throat> okay, so th these magic packs, they definitely are extremely well sealed. I'll give you, I'll give them that. Definitely give them that for sure. <clears throat> Alrighty. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look. Take a peek. Alright, we got food. We've seen this one before. <clears throat> it's going to be the same pack as we had yesterday. Oh, Blind Obedience. It's a new one. It's pretty nice. Should probably sleeve this bad boy up. <clears throat> look at look at the artwork on this one. It's pretty nice. It's called Blind Obedience. Now you can tell it's a special card because it's going to have that kind of like that shiny little pattern in, in the middle. If you guys can see, it's going to have this little shiny pattern in the middle. And it's going to have a star or something, something to symbolize it. It's a little bit more rare than your usual card. Um! All right, I'm going to sleeve that bad boy up right now for you guys. Put that in a separate pile. We also have another special card called Copy Enchantment. Nice. You can tell again with the uh, silver kind of foil in the middle at the bottom. So they just, do they just give you the hit cards right away and then you just hang out with the uncommons and commons afterwards? Like, is that how it works with this? Okay. Again, pollen shield hair. And this has got a um, um, foil in the middle. That's how you can tell. You've got yourself a little bit more rare card than a normal one. Okay, and another foil, Song of Totens, Totentans, I can't even pronounce it very well, Totentans, okay, I'm really trying here, people, if I'm butchering the names, then uh, I'm sorry, I'm not sorry, because I'm new to this game, so it is what it is, new to this trading card, okay, so Song of Totens, the reason I got longer nails is so I can pinch these sleeves easier, you guys are wondering, you know, it's more functional for me. I don't really care about the looks. I care more about the functionality. Okay, so here we've got Devouring Sugarmore. That's a cool looking card. Uh, again, it's got the little symbol in the middle, which means it's definitely more rare than your usual card. Should I be using gloves to open up these cards, or should I just not? Because I heard if there's oils in your skin, it goes into the card, so if it's a rare one, it could affect the value of the card. But I don't know if that's 100% true or not. That's what I've heard. I don't know if it's if it's really, you know, true. Okay, yeah, looks pretty good. Devouring Sugar More. Alright, now we've got our regular cards. We've got our hatching plans. I like this one. It's pretty cool. Now, I, I kind of want to sleeve up all these cards because the artwork on these cards is just so nice. It's got the holographic foil to pretty much all of them. So you pretty much get really good value with these cards, I feel. You know, like, compared to other, other kind of cards. Majority of them have got shiny to them. This one, not so much. Gareth Uprising. All right. I haven't seen this one before. It's a new one. Oh, wow. Look at this one. Forest. Look at the holographic on that. Pretty sweet, man. Pretty sweet. I'm going to sleeve this bad boy up. We're going to do quality over quantity. We got... Obria Dreaming Duelist. That's a nice looking holographic. Number 210. What would be like the benefits of me having a full suit over me just selling individual cards? Let me know in the comment section what you guys think about that. I want to hear your guys' pros and cons. Like I said, I'm new to the magic scene, magic gathering, so I know it's been around for a minute, but I really haven't. You know, I've been more into other stuff. That's nice, man. I like that. Sir Armont the Redeemer. That's a nice looking card. Next card we've got, what I like about these the magic too is you get 15 cards per pack. 
So you get a lot of value for your... Well, you put a lot of money in, so you should get a lot out. Boundary Lands Ranger. Reminds me of Lord of the Rings. That's pretty cool. I'm a huge fan of Lord of the Rings, so that's what kind of got me into the magic kind of scene. Because I like the fantasy adventure and all that. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's not a... I don't know if it's a special card. I don't think so, because you would see some markings on the bottom. Savior of the Sleeping. Again, it's a holographic artwork to it. These cards are kind of thick compared to other cards, so it's hard to get them actually into the, the sleeves. If you guys understand what I'm talking about, let me know. Uh, mint, mint, astri, mint strosity. Minstrosity. I haven't seen this one before. That's a cool looking artwork. Cool for Halloween, this card would be. I'm actually being very careful with these cards too, and it's still tough to get into the sleeves. Uh, Besotted Knight. Pretty cool looking card, nice artwork. Again, it doesn't have uh, any logos on the bottom, anything to identify that it's a special card. It's just normal, either a common, uncommon, or maybe a rare, but it's not like a special, special hit card, you know, that we're looking for. Okay, and we got this one. My cats like to put their paws in there, so that could cause the, the rear card to have damage on it. Under the microscope, of course. Snare Master Sprite. It's the last card. Okay, so let's go back through the cards. We'll start from the... Um, yep. So, we've got... Blind Obedience. Maybe I should turn that off. Let me tilt this. That's better. Got blind obedience. We've got copy enchantment. Okay. We have pollen shield hair. Okay. We've got song of Titans. We have Devouring Sugarmore. Okay. And those are our special cards. Now we have Hatching Plans. Got Garux Uprising. We do have The Forest. We have Obra Dreaming Duelist. We've got Sir Armand the Redeemer. We've got Boundary Lands Ranger. We've got Savior of the Sleeping. Ministry. Besotted Knight. And then we've got a Snare Master Sprite. Don't forget, we've also got food over here to our right. Sounds like a rhyme, doesn't it? Sounds like a rapper rhyme, huh? Uh, and then we've got um, food. Yeah, so food. Okay, cool. So those are our cards for today. That's what we pulled. Let me know in the comment section if there's any card that you like and any card that you thought. Okay, that's some value to it. Let me know as soon as possible. All right, see you guys in the next pool, which will be tomorrow for pack free. Thank you guys for showing up if you're new subscribe to find me because how else are you going to find me? I'm going to get lost in millions and millions of channels. So I'll see you guys later on. Peace out and smash that like if you haven't already done so. Peace out, people.